just beautiful. On my way back from WNCI. What's up, y'all? It's Gage. It has been a while. It's been about three weeks since I've posted a video. I apologize. That's because I, like I said, I have a live radio station I have to keep maintained and I'm updating episodes daily. So it's a lot of work for me. Plus, during the wintertime, I'm not, I'm barely out riding anyway. You guys know this. Like, I barely ride in the wintertime. So basically, wintertime is slow season for you know, this channel, um, obviously summertime is when ATV riding is more, I would say more active, but well, tonight we're going to test out. So right now it's light snowing outside, but it's enough. There's still some snow cover on the, on my driveway that, Hey, you know what? Why not go for a short little plow? Um, it's like 20 some degrees outside. So I don't know how long I'm going to last. <laughs> But I have a package coming in tomorrow, and you know how the post office is. If they see our driveway with snow on it, they're going to be like, oh, nope, can't get unable to make it to the destination or whatever. So I'm going to take care of this tonight um, uh, with the plow. So I got the plow installed, and this is the one from last year. Um, this, it's a Bear Force by Cycle Country. Um, but that's the blade, though. We, um... It's originally made for Grizzlies, but what we had to do is we went to Iron Pony and bought a whole new frame for this blade because we bought this blade originally knowing that it'll probably work on a Can-Am, but no, it only works on Grizzlies. So we replaced this whole frame and it's by Kelpon or I don't know how to say that. It's the Culpin High Rise. That's the frame we used. And then the plow mount plate is under the quad. It's I I always keep it there because it's easy. Um, winch obviously hooks it up. So so in is up. So out is down. It doesn't sound too pretty because the winch is muddy. You can tell I haven't cleaned it. Still, I'm just too lazy. <laughs> that's because I've been riding in the truck out there. I don't know if you could, that's the van, but anyway. All right, so we're gonna go for a little plow. We're gonna check this out. I haven't updated you guys in like centuries, so let's go. snowing out right now driveway is covered in snow I mean not so much over here but maybe about a half an inch to an inch of snow on the ground right now but we're just gonna make sure this plow works so I haven't started this thing up in like almost a month so it barely started you can see on the cold start all right this is gonna be a bitch to steer though so we're gonna go in see it drains the shit out of that Bullshit. I guess I'm doing this. 
this for the fuck's sake. Because why not? I haven't gotten the four wheeler out in a while. I haven't made a video for you guys. So I'm like, you know what? I need to have a valid reason to make a video now. Because I had no valid reason to open you guys. So now I do. By plowing a maybe 0.2 of an inch on the driveway. <laughs> out here. Uh, it's starting to get deep right here. Smelling pretty good. Here's the hill. You guys will remember that. Big hills right there, you can't see it. Ooh, that wind's picking up. I'm not wearing gloves right now, my hands are fucking freezing. for about maybe 10 minutes because my hands are absolutely numb just by holding the camera for one lap. Uh, I did about two more laps after I put the camera down, so plow does pretty good. Um, it almost did no difference out there because there's barely any snow out there, so it, it barely did any difference, but it usually helps for when it snows like, you know, three inches or more, um, but it still does the job. I mean... It, it works. <laughs> it works. It works. So, so glad to have the plow back on this thing. I'll tell you what, it's a bitch steering it while that thing's all the way on the front, though. Um, but I got chains in the back here, but it doesn't do a difference. <laughs> um, all right, well, that'll do it for this little short little update video. Sorry I've been lacking on the posts because, like I said, wintertime is slow season for... Well, for me at least, slow season for four-wheeling. Most people go four-wheeling up there in Canada every day, and it's freezing. I, I can't I can't do that. <laughs> I need to ride in the warm. I'm sure the four-wheelers like riding in the cold, but I don't. <laughs> Rancher's still running. She's still doing good. Um, all right, well, that'll do it. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.